what's going on guys living zombies here back with another pokemon go video and in today's video guys we are talking about go fest yet again do remember we got so much information regarding go fest for in person and the global go fest yesterday that yes necrozma and the shiny of necrozma would be debuting at go fest alongside three new shiny ultra beast pokemon too that shiny zirkatry Feramosa, and buzzwool which i'm so excited for i do love those shinies so so much but yeah into today's video again we are talking about go fest because we have a new data mine from the pokemon group regarding fusion pokemon yet again i have been making a lot of videos about this guys that necrozma with its fusions should be featured at the upcoming go fest event now i do think this will be for the global go fest for the fusions it sounds like the fusions will not be at the in-person go fest events but first things first guys let's take a look at this tweet from the pokemon group this was from like nine days ago the placeholder for two new items has been added to the game's coding yep that's the image that they added so there's no actual image they just said temp 1350 and temp 1351 a temporary placeholder image right there for these two items which many people thought that this would be the items for the Krasma dawn wings and the Krasma dusk main which would be the solarizer item and the lunarizer item as well which it does seem like those people that guessed that were correct because they did just tweet this yesterday these two assets have been moved to fusion resources so the items needed for the fusions so those people were right these probably are in some way the solarizer and the lunarizer item they might call them something different in the game like solar energy or lunar energy who knows what they're gonna actually call this it could be something different but this should be related to the Krasma's fusions now that leads me to the next tweet from the pokemon group which did get tweeted last night as well a bunch of text did get added related to fusion you can't trade pokemon and fusion by the way but all the fusion pokemon including calyrex and also curum and of course necrozma with lunala and solgaleo are added in the text right here and yeah we do see for fusion resource dawn wings necrozma lunar fusion energy so that could be what we just talked about with those placeholder items those could be those items a new type of energy a fusion energy for necrozma's fusions and this leads me to the last tweet that pokemon group did post yesterday niantic is happy they added a bunch of placeholder assets related to fusion they also added some 3d models for raid boss unfused temp and also fusion and unfusion cutscenes for dawn wings and dusk main so again we can't see what the actual items look like because they do have temporary placeholder assets right now and i don't think we have the actual cutscene data mine yet but again they are prepping for the release of dawn wings necrozma and dusk main necrozma as well it does seem like it should be happening at the global go fest because there is also a leak going around to guys that they will be featured at the global go fest now again it is a leak so take it with a grain of salt i don't know how trustworthy it is but i have seen a lot of people talk about this leak but they do mention that there should be some type of fusion raid on day two of the global go fest and i've talked about this too that there should be some fusion raids and when you take down that fusion raid such as dawn wings necrozma you should encounter lunala and i guess the shinies will be available too for lunala and solgaleo as well and we should get those items via a special research on day two of the global go fest those two placeholder items i just talked about whether it's called the energy the fusion energy whatever we should be unlocking that via special research pretty similar to how we got meteorites for rayquaza to teach that dragon ascent and then we were able to mega evolve rayquaza in the game it should be pretty similar to that type of situation so yeah guys it does seem like pokemon go is prepping the release of our first ever fusion fusion pokemon again the Krasma's fusions with lunala and solgaleo for this upcoming global go fest so i can't wait guys if there's any more details that come out about this i will make another video so stay tuned for that make sure you guys do subscribe to the channel so you guys don't miss out on any information about these fusion pokemon but yeah guys comment below your thoughts about fusion the Krasma coming to the game that should be super super awesome i don't think there's any mention of ultra in the Krasma. that should not be 
debuting with the go fest unfortunately but maybe sometime soon after but yeah guys thank you for watching today's video if you enjoyed drop a like in the video subscribe for more and i'll see you guys in the next one peace